when creating a flat pattern of a sheet metal part, the default orientation is automatically determined and applied to the model. However, you can change the default alignment, perhaps for use by automated production machinery or for sheet optimization purposes. Once a flat pattern's orientation has been modified, the modifications will become the default orientation when the flat pattern is placed in a drawing. The sheet metal part in the window has no flat pattern associated with it. You will begin by adding one. On the ribbon, Sheet Metal tab, Flat Pattern panel, select Create Flat Pattern, and a flat pattern is created with the default orientation. You will now modify that orientation. Right click the Flat Pattern node in the browser and select Edit Flat Pattern Definition. The Flat Pattern dialog box opens. On the Orientation tab, you can create named orientations in the Orientations group box by right clicking the default orientation and selecting New. Name your new orientation and then click OK. Double click your new orientation to make it the active orientation. In the Alignment group, the first two options are Align Horizontal, which is selected, or Align Vertical. Select the Align Vertical option and then click Apply. Now click the Alignment Axis button and select one of the edges of the angled slot. Click Apply to update the flat pattern. Notice that the flat pattern is now vertically aligned with the slot. Click the Flip Alignment Axis button and then click Apply. The flat pattern flips vertically. Change the alignment back to Align Horizontal, click Apply, and notice that the flat pattern is now horizontally aligned to the slot. Select the Alignment Axis button again, and select one of the long edges, then click Apply, and the model is back to where it began. Enter 22.5 in the Angle Entry box, and click Apply. The model rotates 22.5 degrees. In the last section on this tab, the Base Face group, there is a button to flip to the opposite face. Click the button, then click Apply, and observe the results. Use the command again to return to the face you are on to start with. Select the Punch Representation tab. Here, you can select from several options for the punch feature representation. The default is Form Punch Feature, but the choices also contain 2D Sketch Representation, 2D Sketch Rep and Center Mark, and Center Mark Only. Switch to the Bend Angle tab, where you can choose from two methods of reporting the bend angle. Report Bending Angle A is the default, or you can choose Report Open Angle B. Click Cancel to exit the Flat Pattern dialog box. The ability to change the orientation of a flat pattern to any pattern you can imagine will go a long way towards getting drawings or digital information out to manufacturing in the most usable configuration. Using the named orientations assures that you will have the correct orientation for the various target audiences.